Jesus Christ. What? YouTube copy strike me again for using a 10 second TikTok in, in the, the beginning. beginning of my video? <laughs> right. Perfect. Right, school is over, exams are finished, way! Except not. Further maths. Yes, I'm gonna play the victim card as much as I want. If you don't know, there's this weird new social network app called Nimses, I think. And I basically found out about it through PewDiePie's um, shout out sponsorship thing. And so I looked into it a little bit, as you would, since it's a pretty obscure, unique sort of idea. And if you haven't heard about it, Nimses is this type of social network that values your life and puts it into currency. So one minute of your real real time life is translated into one name, which is a sort of currency that you have. It's really weird. I'd, there's never, I've never seen anything like it before. This is something straight out of Black Mirror or something, you know? I'm, I'm not sure, but I think the message of it is trying to put a value on human life. So the longer, so the more of your own life you have put into the app, the more reward you get from it. And it's trying to sort of convey that, oh, you can see who has the most names, which means you can see whose life has been put most into the app or like, I mean, if you haven't heard of it, it's weird. You really should check out the videos. I'll, I'll show you, actually. Right, it, yeah, privacy dystopia sounds like a pretty good, you know, summary of it. So let's have a look at this, lads. Hello, my name is Mark. I am 22, and I am wasted. Yeah, you can already see this is some sort of weird, like, trippy, uh, you know, transcendent sort of thing I, I, I can't even describe it. it it is exactly like a privacy dystopia but a more like sort of supernatural like elemental sort of I am an really actual contemporary slave they call me generation Z they write those books about me they fight for my attention they've sold my brain to the brands they've put the price tags on my fingertips my ears my eyes that's it for me. I'm done. I quit. I take my own property, my own body, and quit. Now you can find me in another space. It's artificial, but it is true. It's abstract, but it is kind. Hold on a bit. I will explain. So as you can tell, it's it's like nothing we, we've had, we've experienced before. It's so weird. I mean, I, I'm not registering. This is probably some, you know, some conspiracy st stuff to like hack our brains. I, I don't know. I'm just not installing it or registering because uh, I, don't, I don't I don't feel like it. There can you know there can be risks. I'm not being like whoa everyone. The government's trying to mind mind trick us with this with this nimsus. No, you need to you need to hide while well, you still can. Where the weird tinfoil has to protect itself from the area. No. <clears throat> oh. Jesus. <sighs> so yeah, I mean, I f I'm I'm not taking the risk. Like, this is still me. I have not we're gonna died. sell our the souls to the I'm demons of the Overlord. I am sold no more. I profit from me just being alive. Yeah, you profit from your own life, which it's so. <sighs> we, you know, we're, we're, this is gonna create a whole new like industry of. Black Mirror esque. I mean, a lot of stuff from Black Mirror has actually come true. I'm, I'm just gushing over Black Mirror now. Alright, I'll stop. I'm just. The Black Mirror is really cool. Season 5, you should watch it. It's great. My only property, my body, produces value. It makes one precious digit every minute out of nothing. One min. Like this. By out of nothing, I mean out of minutes. Once more, pay close attention. I live one minute, and this very minute is recorded somewhere on the internet. It does not simply sink into the oblivion. I can retrieve it. Made out of nothing, the NIM is so much more than nothing. It is a precious thing which I possess without any obligations. It's mine. 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 I use it how I, I, I want. What do I want? I want... I want to be observed. I want to be followed. 
I want to be acknowledged. I want to be important in your eyes. I want you to be willing to pay attention undividedly to me. I want to grab and hold your mind. I want you to not be able to take your eyes off me. I want, like, to be more than just a human. You know, I'll introduce myself once more. Hello, my name is Mark. I am 22. I am an angel. Follow me. As you can see, this this is a real thing, by the way. Can I just say this is a real this is a real thing? If this might seem like some of that way in like the future dystopia where I don't know, it's it's mental, it is. And I'd, honestly, there's so many issues like about privacy and whatever. But I was literally just ice at that point, and uh, yeah, there's a lot of debates about that. But I, I think it's just so cool and like. I really want to delve into this and see where it takes where like if enough people get involved this could be mental I've had an idea recently I've been I've been following this guy for a while now I've been getting some I've been getting some ideas as you can see he does this series called editor reacts right I'll just um see editor reacts to like all he does I mean, I mean, not to hate on him or anything, he's a great guy, I mean, he can do, he can edit stuff way better than I ever could, I'm just saying, he does some pretty, you know, surface level analysis and gets a lot of views, a lot of views, and it's just editor reacts to, you know, random cinematog cinematography edits. I reckon I could do this, it wouldn't be too hard, just editor react, pro YouTuber reacts, since I am obviously a pro YouTuber. Pro YouTuber reacts to you know whatever video. Right, let's see what's on them um, trending at the moment. Let's see if anything's. I mean, this is all going to be irrelevant. In there. Oh, yesterday Dan Howell basically I'm gay. Good to know, mate. Good to know. We're all, we've all known from the beginning, but good to know. I'll just there we go. Right, I've been recording for a while. This video's not getting anywhere. Um, bulking season is over, mate. I doubt it. G fuel. Jesus gives me energy. Christ. <laughs> also keeps me focused so I can do things. This somebody help me! Also I mean in some of his videos KSI looks like he's on something, but he's taken it a bit far, lads. And antioxidants. <gasps> Surprised you can even say the word antioxidants. <gasps> Fruit when you can have over 25 sugar free flavors. Did a good job memorizing that script then. Well, you can't shut up! But the real reason I drink G Fuel is so I can do this. Get it now at gfuel.com. Don't think G Fuel's the only thing he's been on while he was filming that. I'm gonna have a bunch of gaming videos coming to you on the gaming channel, link in the description, throughout the summer because I'll have nothing to do. That was your episode, your daily, weekly fix of. What am I gonna call this series where I just sit down and look at random stuff and talk about nonsense? What do I call it? I don't even have a name for it. You know, who cares? Who cares?